Hi guys, Vlogtober, day 29. That means short story number 29. That means I don't have many more to come up with. <laughs> Let's get to it. Halloween night was chilly. The moon was covered in a blanket of clouds. The streets were alive with cheers and laughter as the children dressed in their costumes went door to door in the quest for as much candy as they could possibly get. Ten-year-old Runa, dressed as a witch, stood outside the old abandoned mansion. It was rumored to be haunted, but she didn't care. She had been fascinated by it her whole entire life. That Halloween night, she felt a pull to it. It was unexplainable. She walked up the stone pathway. The front door creaked open, inviting her in. She turned on her flashlight as she stepped inside. She roamed the halls of the mansion and saw a flicker of candlelight that caught her eye. She opened the door to see a grand library. Shelves lined the room, each one filled with old books. She was drawn to a book that lay open on the round table in the middle of the room. The page said that it was a release spell. Runa traced her fingers over the text. She instinctively read the words aloud, and the room filled with shimmering light as ghostly figures appeared, their eyes full of hope. Please free us, one of them whispered. We've been trapped here for so long. The witch is here to free us, another one said excitedly. Runa continued to read as the figures started glowing brighter. She felt an energy coursing through her. The ghostly figures smiled as they burst into several sparkling dust-like particles, leaving behind a warm glow. Runa realized that not only had she freed the ghosts that haunted the old mansion with the release spell, but she had also released her own inner magic, a magic that she had sensed was in her for years. She knew one thing for sure. Things were never going to be the same after that night. The end. So yeah, again, we are here back with the witchy magic. Don't judge me. Blame Marvel. Blame Agatha Harkness. <laughs> You can also blame the Wicked Witch of the West because she's cool too. But <laughs> blame Agatha Harkness for being in the witchy mood. Um, <laughs> yeah, um, this one was random, as a lot of them have been. Um, but yeah, let me know what did you guys think of this story and come back tomorrow for day 30 of Vlogtober. We got two days left. Two days two days. Bye guys. <laughs>